when we watch you on the pitch, you're clearly focused on the job in hand. But it's quite funny because as soon as the full-time whistle goes, it's almost like you turn into the Celtic fan, the way you celebrate with the supporters, and it's, we see the two sides of you. Is that is that what it is? <laughs> yeah, and uh, during the game, you just need to keep the fan kind of limited um, and just be professional about it and do your job, and that's what I try to do. Then as soon as the final whistle goes, then I'm just the fan again, and I love every single minute of it. I suppose it's a case of, you know, you know how to work hard and, and, and play hard, but it's a case of keeping those different parts of your personality in check. Yeah, you're always, even on the pitch, you're always a Celtic fan, you're always going to give your all for Celtic. Um, and that's what matters, and to me, to live the moments that I've lived and after the Cup, the celebrations is just incredible for me. Do you think this, the, the, the boys in the squad who, you know, the Scottish boys who are Celtic fans, do you think they feel it differently, personally, and perhaps more, or as well as professionally? Um, I'm not sure because everybody, everybody's given 100%, everybody wants to win. The thing that I feel is, is quite tough as well is um, being the Celtic fan, like, after you go away from the game or training, you're going to be, all your friends that are Celtics, so you're talking about every day and it means a lot and you know how much it means to everybody um, and so when you win it makes it that extra special for you.